We're going to explain how to connect a Ubodi keyboard to your iPad. One, first, make sure your Ubodi keyboard is charged. A low battery can prevent connection. Two, next, turn on your Ubodi keyboard. The method for this varies slightly depending on the specific model, but usually involves a power switch or pressing a key combination. Check your keyboard's manual if you're unsure. Three, now on your iPad, go to settings. Four, in settings, tap on Bluetooth. Five, make sure Bluetooth is turned on. If it's not, toggle the switch to activate it. Six, your iPad will now start scanning for nearby Bluetooth devices. You should see your Ubodi keyboard appear in the list of available devices. It might be listed as something like Ubodi keyboard or a similar name. Seven, tap on the name of your Ubodi keyboard in the list of available devices. Eight, your iPad will then pair with the keyboard. This may take a few seconds. You might see a code on both your iPad screen and the keyboard. Ensure they match, if prompted. Nine. Once paired, you should be able to start typing on your Ubodi keyboard. If you encounter problems, ensure Bluetooth is enabled on both the keyboard and iPad and that the keyboard is sufficiently charged. Ten. If the keyboard doesn't show up, try restarting both your iPad and the keyboard. Eleven. If you still have issues, double check your keyboard's manual for specific pairing instructions or contact Ubodi's customer support for assistance. Remember, some Ubodi keyboards might utilize a slightly different connection method, so consult your specific keyboard's user manual for any model specific instructions. 12. After successfully connecting, you can now use your Ubodi keyboard to type on your iPad, making note taking, emailing, and other typing tasks much easier.